the allocation for Ministry of Health was cut by 280 million in budget 2016 and now we start seeing its consequences. Pathology Department of the Glen Hospital has issued a circular dated 6 September 6, notifying hospital staff of a temporary halt in uh, pathology uh, laboratory investigations as the department was unable to purchase necessary chemical reagents due to inadequate fun, pumps. A postage cancer patient uh, sought a blood test in Batu Pahat Hospital but was told he, the test might, the result might take a few days because the hospital need to send need to send the sample to the JB hospital because the Batu Pahat hospital ran out of its allocation to run the to run the blood test. Selayang hospital also did not have chemical reagent to run creatinine uh, blood test in end of September. That was last month. And some of the clinic kesehatan in our country stop doing screening for Hep B for pregnant women, even though Hep B is highly prevalent in our nation. Mini, uh, health Ministry has seen an increment in the number of patients seeking healthcare services in public health facilities, especially after the implementation of GST with an estimate 8% increase in patients from January to May this year compared to the same period in the past year. This translates to over 300 million additional patients who are visiting the public health care uh, facilities. Therefore, I fully agree with the DG of Health, Datuk No Hisham Adula, who has acknowledged the challenges faced by Ministry of Health in providing quality healthcare services with restricted resources, especially with increase in demand. Allocation for Ministry of Health in 2015 was 23.31 billion, but was, uh, 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 but was reduced, reduced to 23.03 billion in budget 2016. However, at the same time, Allocation for PN's department was increased from 19.2 billion to 20.3 billion. So my question to our Prime Minister is this. What projects under PN's department can be more important than saving lives?